Hi everybody, it's Crafty Glamper 77. I'm here with my first Costco haul. Don't know how to do it, so I'm just gonna just do it on the fly. So bear with me. <clears throat> it's kind of all of a mess, but I did try to organize stuff in order of the product. And then I have a small Dollar Tree haul after this. So, um, let me get my, how much everything was. We don't go to Costco very often. We go once every, I don't know, five, six weeks, maybe even longer than that. Um, our total today was 424.22. It's always what it seems like our average is. We've definitely spent more before, and I think the least we've ever spent is probably about 250. So I will tell you prices with it. I mean, not, I don't really know if you guys care about that, but I will tell you the prices. Um, let me get my purse all the way. I am carrying my Sheen purse for people that watch my haul. This is my Timu strap that I bought for it. It's just that corduroy purse. I do love it, except when you put your phone out here, um, it's heavy, so it can kind of go out and you have to make sure it doesn't fall out or nothing else spills out of your purse but I do love my corduroy purse. All right, I'll put it over here. On these waters right here, our little small town store, you get a case of 24 and it's for like 798. And they're 24, um, 40, they're 40 packs on their waters. And we get the Ice Mountain. Um, those are 649 a piece for 40 bottles. We got five cases. I did not want to bring all five in here, so we just brought one. But yeah, it is a 40 and they're 0.5 liter bottles, which is really good. Um, Harley uses pads because we live right by a very busy road and we have no fence. Um, so she has been trained on these and uses these. We first started going, I think they were like I don't know, 14, 15 something, but it might take me too long to go through this. So I don't really know if you guys want to hear me ramble for prices, but right here is what they are. They're nice. Um, they last for a long time, quite a while. Um, there's a hundred in them. We get the extra large size and they only do this. Oh, it's 30 inches by 23 inches. So. And it is the Kirkland brand, which Costco's off brand is Kirkland. And we buy their detergent, their brand paper towels, everything. Cause it's just as good as brand name itself. Our opinion, just our opinion. Hi baby. And for the dog pads, those were, I could have just wrote on stuff, huh? You guys don't really care about this part of it. Um, I'm gonna go through one more time, but I didn't see it. So, it's on there, but somehow I, oh, 17.49. Those are 17.49 now. Um, I'm gonna stay with this kind of stuff. We'll go to the food and work our way over. Our granddaughters love these fruit snacks. You get 90, yeah. There's 90 in there is the Welch's brand. And these right here, it's gonna take forever, isn't it? <laughs> um, I know the big ones out there don't really care. I, for one, like the longer hauls. There's other people who are like, just, you know, get on with it. But this is gonna be a longer one because I'm gonna have to look them all up. But these, for the grand babies, were $13.69 for 90. It's a 90 pack. Yes, and they're 0.8 ounces. So it's just like the ones that you buy at the store. Oh, I don't wear jeans too often. You really can't see these and I can't do anything, but these jeans and they're ripped. These are from Sheen. I'm 4'11", so they're really long. Um, yes, this is a Costco haul, but I'm getting off subject. They were so long, they were laying on top of my, floor, on my foot onto the floor, so I cut off about this much. Um, it's starting to fray just by the washing. But I really, really like them. They're nice and stretchy and they're very comfortable. And I do have my Timu necklace on. Me and the granddaughters just did a haul um, 
Friday. I'll have to upload it tomorrow at work Monday. This is Sunday the 28th. So I might get two videos up tomorrow, this one and the ones me and the granddaughters were in. But in that haul, I got these little earrings for under a dollar. And I'm wearing those today and I really like them. I think they're cute. So, okay, back with it. Let's see, fruit snacks, push them all the way. Popcorn, love the popcorn. You get 44 in this. It is so good. I'm trying to get out of that ring. So good, love this popcorn. Some people like it really buttery. I'm like on the light butter and that's what this is. And I drown it in Parmesan cheese good stuff stinks but um it's amazing so yeah and my hair is a wreck it is so windy and cold here today in indian and rainy i am a hot mess today but i don't want to take the time to do anything with myself i should just threw my hat on it's actually over there but anywho 44 3.3 ounce bags so it's your normal size bags it's the kirkland brand and it is good so i got those and those were those used to be $11.99. Everything's gone up. It just stresses me out. And Dave was always like, it's going up everywhere. All the prices are. You know, we just got to get used to it. It's a hard one to swallow sometimes. All those increases on everything really add up. Um, mommy be down a little bit hard. A little bit. Hold on, baby. Those were... $14.99. So they went up three bucks in the few years, which I, maybe that's not bad that we've had our Costco membership. I think we've had it at least for four or something. Okay, so got that. Um, and a bag of Doritos. Those were $6.99, I believe. Doritos were $6.99. Um, it is the great big bag. It is actually full right here. This is your air pocket and it is full right here. We buy this in our little town grocery store, just the small bag. The small bag is really skinny and it, like half of it's full. And sometimes they're two for seven. So you got this whole great big bag. And it's literally full to right here for $6.99. Um, it's 30 ounces, so you have a whole pound 14 ounces here. So that's pretty good. And we got the cool range. We would have got the plane, but they didn't have a plane, which is fine. So I like these two. Um, and we got some apples. And I think these were, hold on, I just saw those. I thought I did. <clears throat> Excuse me. These were. Do, 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 and I love to eat apples by themselves. And I just have to take the skin off. I don't like skin. I love them by themselves or dipped in peanut butter. That's probably my favorite way is dipped in peanut butter. So yes, we got us some of those. And they do say sweet on there. So you'll know. Then we got some of this. I'll probably eat some too, but um, our daughter likes this. Um, it's grains, ancient grains, probiotic granola and it has with Kemet, Kemet, I don't know brand wheat, spelt almonds, quinoa and Amarinanth Amarinanth, I don't even know how to say that Kirkland brand once again it's got probiotic cultures in it, it supports your immune and digestive system, but it's a great big bag great big bag and they, this is two pounds and 3.3 .3 ounces. So it is a nice size bag. So yeah, we got some granola. Sorry, that ring light must have been open up. And then, so I don't know where everybody's from, but maybe different parts don't have Girl Scouts and Boy Scouts, but they're, it's a little club for kids and they have different ages and they get to do things and they 
earn badges for their uniforms and stuff like that. Well, one of the things that Girl Scouts does is they sell Girl Scout mint cookies. Love them. They're outrageous. I think they're like $6 a little box now. Pop them babies in the freezer and eat them. I can eat the whole box. Oh my gosh, they're so good. Well, these are Girl Scout Thin Mint Pretzels. Yeah. Girl Scout Thin Mint Pretzels. Look at that. Yum. Mm, you know those are going to be good. No artificial preservatives, flavors, or colors. Girl Scout powers life-changing experiences for girls. This is officially licensed by Girl Scouts of the USA, a nonprofit. Um, there's 26 ounces, one pound and 10 ounces in here. But yeah, hubby found those. That was a good find. Um, and then Kirkland brand once again, fancy whole cashews with sea salt. We got these and I think they were 12, which peanut, any kind of nut is expensive. Nuts are just pricey. Um, $12.49 is what we paid for those. Excuse me, guys, girls, ladies, gentlemen. 40 ounces. There's two and a half pounds in here. So that's really good. That light. Here, just put it in front of me. And yeah, like those are called fancy hair cashews with sea salt. And then <clears throat> there's, oh my word, three pounds, 12 ounces. There's almost four pounds. But we got the Frigio, I don't know how to say it, string cheese. It is a huge pack. I don't know how many is in there because it really doesn't tell you that. It just tells you there's three, thir three pounds, 12 ounces in there. Got till May of 24. Those will be eaten with no problem. Just a nice little low calorie snack. They're 80, um, 80 calories. But yeah, we got those. And the cheese was, I can buy some of these. Excuse me. Bless me. Sorry, guys. Whew. Okay. String cheese was eleven forty nine for all that, so that was really good. We got that. Hubby loves mushrooms. I do too. Um, but we got a twelve pack of these mushrooms right here. Cans. They're the organic sliced mushrooms. Um, <coughs> there's twelve four ounce cans. Packed from fresh mushrooms, simple simple ingredients. It says they're four ounce cans, but it's funny. Okay. Down here, it says 12 four ounce cans. Here, on the demo picture, it says six, 6 six ounces. I don't know if you can see that, but it, it does say that on there. My light ring's probably messing that up. But anywho, I'm sure it's the four ounces. But yeah, we got those. And I did say what those were, right? 12, 12 dollars for 12, so just a dollar and some change per can. So we got that. Street corn dip, y'all. Oh my gosh, we love this street corn dip. But it stressed me out for how much it was this time. We paid, this is what it is. And you get 32 ounces, so there is two pounds in here. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. Our daughter and her boyfriend can just about eat half the bowl in one setting, just the two of them. So we normally grab two. I mean, it's that good. Um, it is mild. I can't go on real spicy stuff, so this is about the peak of what I can do. But it's absolutely delicious. It's Rojo's, Rojo's. I say Rojo's, I don't know. But that's what it is, and we did get two. Those this time <coughs> was eight eighty nine. Last time we went, they were five ninety nine. So I don't know if they really cranked their prices up on that, or when we went and got the last two for that lower price, maybe it was on their ad for that week, like on sale. So I I really don't know. I really hope when I go back next time, it's not eight eighty nine, but it's delicious. We're gonna freeze one and put one in the fridge. So there's that. Oh, and on with a little bit more food stuff. 
Here, come here, Mark. Oh, here. There you go. <laughs> Don't let them. You sound like a little piggy. We just got home, and I'm not paying much attention to her. I went straight into doing this haul. So she's just being a little bit needy, aren't you, baby? Say hi. Say hi. Just want some sugars. Or want some sugars, and she probably won't want me to put her down either. She's tensing up. Come on. Mommy's gonna finish this, okay? And then, <clears throat> I know, baby. Hold on. Go lay down. Hold on. Lay down just a little bit. I get this great big one of Parmesan cheese for my popcorn and spaghetti, of course, but for my popcorn. Um, uh, da, 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 da. Where are you at? Parmesan, $7.89. $7.89. And our little hometown stores, which I guess I they have to make money. He's the only store in this town besides, you know, you gas stations. And we have a dollar store and a new Dollar Tree. But um, it's just those small stores are so outrageous on stuff. But you got to support your local town to your local stores and businesses so we definitely spend a lot of money there too like i said we only go here every few weeks but this is 24 ounces it's got a pound and eight ounces of this and i can buy a half or not smaller for like five or six bucks maybe at walmart maybe that much but yeah those is whatever i said it was because i can't find it hold on harley 7.89 for that hold on baby and then we got the two pack, 28 ounces in both bottles. So 56, 56 ounces in the Olive Garden dressing. Love this stuff. $8.99 for two bottles, which I don't think that's bad at all. So yeah, really excited about that. I love this stuff. And then of course, I think this was six something. Each bottle is two pounds and eight ounces. And we go through a lot of this, especially in the summer when we're camping. But I got the Sweet Baby Ray sauce. So for two huge bottles, that was $6.69. So that's a really good buy for those. A couple little recipes on the back. But yeah, good buy. And we just get the regular Sweet Baby Rays. Love it. Love it, love it. It's our fave. And then <clears throat> we got... I went ahead and got one of these a little splurge for today um i'm not used to wearing necklaces and my shirts you'll see in my videos i'm constantly doing this but especially hooded sweatshirts they they pull your shirt down so i'm always adjusting my shirt well, i'm bad for going like this and pulling and i keep getting my fingers hooked up in this i know i'm gonna snap it i hope i don't because i actually really like it in one of my holes i think i have matching earrings in there to go with it but anyway we did a little splurge we got the sea salt, so it has the pepper grinder, and then we got the spare. So they're both completely full. So we get a total of 13 ounces and one pound and 10 ounces. So there's two pounds, there's over two pounds. So that's awesome, and salt. Um, no, total net. I'm sorry, the total net is one pound, 10 ounces, so 26 ounces. They're two 13 ounce bottles. But what's nice is when you go back, they have these short fat ones like this that are like $5 and something that is that you can just refill. Probably refill it twice. So it's only five something for the refill. But this right here for the salt. And we got a pepper one too. Like I said, that was her little splurge. Um, <clears throat> wow, where did that go? Bum, 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 bum. Oh, salt was $6.69. So this was $6.69, but we have a grinder. You're also buying the grinder, so it's not like you're buying a grinder store and then having to dip the salt to fill it. It's kind of nice, already together. Arlene, baby, hold on, okay? Hold on. We also did the same with the pepper. It comes with the grinder and it comes with the full refill. And the pepper, hold on, these were together. The pepper was $7.99, and I think when you get the the jar to fill it up, it was six something, I think. But it would fill it up more than once. So 
Yeah, and uh, once again, let's see. The total for these two bottles is 12.6 ounces. Each bottle is 6.3. So it is the Kirkland brand. I hope I, there we go. It's the Kirkland brand there. I don't know if that's a thumbnail or not. <laughs> With salt and pepper. <laughs> Do this. this um, Let's try another little thumbnail. Yum. Yum. Okay. Thumbnails make you feel so silly when you're doing them. I literally replay the video and I just screenshot a couple and then I just pick one. Um, okay, so we got that. Oh, that shown. I love the beads. And we get these in Kirkland, too. They're cheaper than the Downy. The Downy was almost $20. We got two. And it is the spring scent. Believe it or not, you can almost smell it. Not in this one. But this one, maybe the seal's not as tight. But um, it's the spring scent. It is Kirkland brand. And they are so, so good. I love these. I'm addicted to the beads. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ugh, there's a mess. But anyway, it is for the HEs. I think maybe you can use it on the regular. I won't say yes, and I wouldn't want to make anybody try it and be wrong. Um, get almost three pounds. There's 2.87 pounds of beads in here. And it is the spring fresh scent. Got two of those. And these mm. Oop. pulled on my shirt. Oh my word. Oh, no. Okay, $13.99. My eyes are about to go cross. Um, yeah, these are $13.99. I just about lost my my tripod. <laughs> I have you propped up on my crossway down here. I just sit it down here instead of in, I want to carry everything up in my craft room. So we just brought it in here and put it on the table. But yeah, so good, good bye. So I'll do another one. And that probably will not be my thumbnail. All right, so we got that. <clears throat> I love their detergent. Of course, the soft, the, um, I haven't used that other brand in so long. I can't tell you even what it's called. You guys probably can. Tide. That's what I'm thinking of. Tide had less loads. This does not, I don't use the, that loads. Mine's way less on any kind that I get because I load my um, liquid up more than what it should be. I always put extra in. I do the same thing with my softener, so it never is the correct loads for me. But Kirkland Signature, 146 loads, and it smells really good. It almost smells like Thai, but it's just got its own smell, and it's really good. It gets my clothes clean. We've used it for years. We even get the pods. I have a bag of pods back there. But today, I was out of the liquid, and I got liquid. So that's what that looks like. And it is the Kirkland brand, and it is 1.51 gallons. So, premium laundry detergent, tough stain, fighting power, odor eliminating technology. But really, it is good. It, to me, it's like a Tide dupe. So, without the Tide name and the Tide price. So, um, hold on, honey. Also, get their store brand of Kirkland's. <clears throat> it matches the beads, the April Fresh. Got everything the same. 276 loads. It won't be that, but I mean, it lasts a long time. It's a great big jug. I love Owl. <laughs> Can't deny that one when it's caught on camera. That'll leave a mark. 
But anyway, I like that it has these because earlier, like from one of my first hauls on Timu, got those little trays that hook and they come out like this and then you just sit your cup on it. So then you can just push your button and the cup's sitting there and fills it up. Yeah, it's already getting red. What a goober, right on camera. I mean, for the whole world to see. Gee, should be the Fabric protection technology, odor eliminating, but it's the spring fresh scent. I'm pretty sure I said that, but in case I didn't. Love that stuff. And of course, had to get Harley. Oh, I'm wearing my, you probably can't see it, but my Willie Nelson shirt my daughter got me for Christmas. Um, we got the Made in the USA. Probably need that with all the Timu stuff that I buy from across the seas. But anywho, Made in the USA with the world's finest ingredients. It's the blue brand. Um, top shoes, natural dog treats, enhanced with minerals, chicken and apple recipe, sausage bites. Harley loves these. And she is just a, um, she's half Yorkie and half Havanese. So she's supposed to be 10 to 12 pounds, but she's like a 16 pound dog because she's a little spoiled. But with these treats, they're easy to break and I can break them in two to three pieces. So they actually last quite a while. Grilled chicken is the number one ingredient, no artificial preservatives. Anybody else that used to watch that dog, um, dog show, Lassie? The black and white one with the little, the, the real show. I used to watch that, I love that show. But anywho, that's what I got for her. Me and dad then, I told her, I told her daddy gets it for her. I spoil her, she needs to know he spoils her too. So there's that. See, I'm the one that gives her the treats. He doesn't give her treats. He's like, you fatten her up enough, basically. So, I let her know he bought them. And then for 120 tablets, this will last me for four months. If you've watched my channel, yes, I've had a nasty call forever. Don't know what's going down. If I take a deep breath, you can kind of hear me squeak, wheeze. I don't know, make a noise. Getting coughing fits. If um, I get too hot, especially if I laugh, I start coughing. It's awful, it's so annoying, but um, I probably need to go to get checked. I just hate making bills and then just getting on more antibiotics because the first time months ago in October when I got sick and this cough started, they said, oh, it's lasting like six to eight weeks, got me antibiotics, steroids, everything for all the sickness that I had at the time with the cough, even a prescription cough medicine and I got it refilled and I still have the cough, so. But and someone else did at school, their daughter did, and she said that her, well, her sister's a nurse, and um, she's been giving her daughter this, and she doesn't, I don't think it's really so much that she has allergies, but she has a nasty cough and has had it for a while. Whatever is in the Zyrtec seems to help my cough. There's something in there that helps that. So I've literally taken one a day for a couple months. But um, this is 124, 120 tablets. It was the most expensive thing we bought, but it's like four months worth. And so it's like $10 and 50 cents a month. Um, they were four, $42.99. So I did get those. They had the gel, um, like 60 or 70 was in it. It was just a few dollars less. So you almost got double just to get a, the hard capsule. So I did that and got 120. So that'll last me a while, but yeah did get those so that's actually a good buy very good buy and it's the 10 milligram so and it's so funny it even says 24 hour relief sneezing itchy watery eyes runny nose itchy throat or nose there is nothing in there at all about a cough but it helps my cough I don't know y'all but it works so I take it I love these pants but the pockets are really little on them and they're off to the side. So you've got like between your pocket and the seam of your pant, like this much room. It's kind of weird. I don't like the butt of them. So I, I keep pulling my shirt down to cover. Not that y'all would look at it anyway, but if you see me tugging on my shirt, I do this all the time anyways, cause it moves around, drives me nuts, but I keep pulling it past my, my bum. 
But yeah, got those. Um, we got these two huge totes. There's two black ones with these lids. Normally they're $9.99. And today, I mean, everybody we saw, it seemed like at least three, four out of 10 people we saw had a, these in their cart, more than one. And, <clears throat> sorry, I had these <coughs> a second ago too. A towel. What is this KS towel? Oh, paper towels. Okay. Let me find them. Okay, they're 27 gallon storage. They were $8.99 today. Um, actually, I thought on the thing it said $7.99, but it rang up $8.99. Still a good deal. I mean, they're regular $10. I could have swore that sign said $7.99. It was like the lowest we'd ever seen them. But anywho, we got two. We can always use storage totes, but it is 27 gallons. It's the, got the black bucket, um, and then you've got your, it's almost like the cat colors. You got your black and then the yellow top. Hold on, baby. Hold on. I just got three more things off of Costco, and then me and my husband did make a small Dollar Tree haul. I've debated whether showing it because a lot of it's food and snacks, and I just don't know if you guys really care, but I'll let you know when I'm done with this, and if you don't want to mess with my haul, you can just jump right off there and watch your next video. So, if you're one of my normal people that come in and watch me all the time, thanks for jumping in, spending time with me. If you're new, I hope you've enjoyed it so far, and thanks for jumping on and watching. I appreciate it. Um, if you want to like, you can. I don't push any of the like and share, and I might mention it every once in a while, but I guess it does help our channels. I mean, I'm not sponsored, so maybe it doesn't matter. I don't really know how all that works. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, this is the only toilet paper we use. <laughs> it is the Kirkland brand. Once again, they're huge, thick rolls. You get 30 rolls, 380 sheets. That's the wide kind. Um, but yeah, there's one, two, three. There is five six packs in here. That's how they separate them. So, but yeah, they're really nice. We love them. This is the only kind that we use. Um, got that toilet paper. Why did my ticket? Let's tell y'all how much toilet paper cost. I don't really know if you care. But I'm going to tell you guys anyway, because I have on everything else. Might as well keep it going. I hope everybody's had a great weekend. We have. We've had the grandbabies. We did a haul Friday, which I'll upload tomorrow. It is all over the place, the haul is. If you see me in the background, I'm kind of stepping back. And this is my nervous thing. I do this a lot. I was getting kind of anxious because I. it's just the way I am. I kind of want to jump in and help and not really take over, but I just, you know, I didn't want to hover, but I kept catching myself wanting to go in and help. But um, it was really hard for me to stand back. And I mean, I might have helped on some things, but it was really hard just to stand back there and watch and let them go to town. But they did. I thought I would have to help them with talking. Those girls didn't, you know, help with talking. They filled in the whole video. They're little chatty Cathy's. Um, but they're really, they're a lot of fun. We had a good time. So, but what I was saying, that haul is really all over the place, but please, nothing but nice comments. I mean, Mia's 12, Ava is eight, so, but they had a great time doing it. That's all that mattered. It, like I said on the thing when I post on my community, it just made my heart happy being able to do it. But, um, let's see, the toilet paper was $19.49 and the paper towels were $19.49. We get those in the Kirkland brand also. This big thing, you get 12. There's 12, there's 160 on each roll. So there is a bunch. They are individually plastic in their wrap. I'm sure that's how all of the others are. I haven't bought bulk in any other brand, so I'm assuming. But yeah, that's what we get in those. And then, Allie, our grandbaby's mom and dad knew that we were going and they gave us $25 to get their paper towels. I think Bounty is 24, it was $24.99 for Bounty. Wait, did she void that? I 
does that say void? Hmm. I thought their bounty was 22 something. But anywho, it says 24.99 on here. Oh. 19.49 for tissues. It was right actually our toilet paper the Kirkland brand. It was 19 49 got two dollars off that was their thing for the week so it was really 1749 and then um the paper towels were 1949 okay and then it says bounty was the 2499 so they got bounty it's the advanced quicker picker upper um there is 12 rolls in here the, ours has 12 rolls in the bounty. There's less on the rolls, I think. For There's 101, and then on these, there's 160 on the Kirkland brand, the store brand. But, um, you know, everybody knows the bounty brand. They're good. They've been around for years. But to us, Kirkland is just as good. We like them. Um, but we have used bounty before, too, but we haven't bought them at Costco. But that's what they got. So... Just everything I've showed you right here with Zyrtec, my medicine, being the most expensive. It was $424.22. Almost $15 tax. So, but yeah. That's that. So, if you were just on here for my first Costco haul, it is done. Um, I'm getting ready to go ahead. I've got like four or five bags of the Dollar Tree. So, I'll show you. So, if you want to see that. Go ahead and stay on here. Um, it's all off to the side because I ran out of room. I'm gonna use this here. Get this done because I'm sure my hubby, he went upstairs so I could do this, but he's probably waiting on some of these snacks. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll get these done. I cannot do the scanner. I have the Walmart scanner downloaded because I've been watching Dollar Tree hauls and they said someone I watched was doing this to price check at the Dollar Tree scan stuff and it, it will give you the Walmart price if you paid it there and you would not believe what stuff cost at Walmart that you're getting for a dollar and a twenty-five a dollar and a quarter at the Dollar Tree. I was showing him and scanning with him and there's a couple of times he says well how much would this be and <laughs> I'd be scanning stuff for him so I he was kind of getting into it too, whether he probably knit it or not. Okay, anyway, I got Arm & Hammer Essentials Liquid Hand Soap, and this is the Tropical Mango. So I got this, and I think, oh, I wish I didn't have to record on my phone. It smells so refreshing. I should have got a couple. Um, I wanna say it was eight something at Walmart. I'm not 100%, but I really do think it was like eight or nine. So, isn't that crazy? That little tiny thing will cost that. It's like 12 ounces. I got that. Um, picked up the grandbabies. Just a couple more things. Ava's the youngest one. She's the little diva. She was when you watch the haul with them in it. She's the one that had all, she's the littlest one. She had all the crafting stuff. But she loves her makeup. So, we found some cute little different nails that were pretty. And then... Um, oh, got her this LA Colors, and it's Lustrous is the name, and it's Shimmer Jelly Lip Gloss. So we also, this light up here, y'all, LA Colors, where can I put you? I don't know, but anyway, it's really cute, really pretty color, and I can't swatch them, I'm not going to open it because it's for them. Um, this right here came up like... $5.99 or $6.99 if I was to buy it at Walmart. But I got the black and it's the Auto Eyeliner Smooth Application. Cruelty free. That is always a definite bonus. Smudge proof. It's LA Color brand, but I got me some eyeliner. And this right here, I won't this I think was $11.99. Makeup is so expensive. Oh my gosh. You get used to paying these cheaper prices, and when you go other places, you're like Oh my gosh. Makeup stick. It twists up. It is also cruelty free. It's the LA Color brand. Lipstick brush and eyeshadow. And it's pink satin. And I really thought that was a pretty color. I will probably not use it at all for anything on my eyes because I don't do pink. 
I do like browns and a little bit, well, it's almost off, black eyeliner. Um, so yeah, I don't do pink on there. So this will probably be my blush. So there's that. And then these, <clears throat> I can't remember if they're like $8.99 or something. They had the plain white, which I think is unscented. Couldn't really smell it through there. Anytime <clears throat> I go to the Dollar Tree and these are there, I'm going to buy them because they're they're like nine bucks at Walmart and you're paying a dollar and a quarter and it's for the Dermacell with aloe fresh. Oh my gosh, love this stuff. It smells so good. And I am work at the school, okay, in the kitchen. So my hands are in water a lot, they're in gloves a lot, but I get so dry through here and here, especially. They feel real rough. Um, but there's times I'm mean, just dry all over. It just fills in every crack and cranny on your hand and it doesn't leave you greasy because I don't like that greasy feel. So this is amazing. Love it. Love it. I bought that honestly so many times. And then this is Dermacell hand wash. And I want to say this was between, it's going to be a wide gap, but it's because I scan so much stuff. Um, eight to 11 and I don't remember. But it's Dermacell Extra Moisturizing Hand Wash. Leaves skin feeling clean and soft with pleasant cherry almond scent. Cherry almond, honestly, is not one of my favorites. But for this brand and the price, yeah, we're going to use that. So I got that. Okay. What are we at? 40, oh, wow. 41 minutes. Okay, so let's put all this back in here. And the girls have their own playroom. I could kind of walk you guys back there and see it. My house is a mess though. I might do that another time. But they do have their own big playroom. And anytime they come over, maybe it's a bad thing to start. I don't know. He's, you're allowed to spoil your grandbabies. That's okay. Um, usually when they come over, not every time, but there's usually a little some kind of surprise in their room waiting for each of them or something for both of them. So... <clears throat> On my, one of my, I think it was my very last haul. I had to wait to do it because we we're having a late Christmas with them and some of their stuff was in it. But that pin that had the different colors and the pom-poms, I got those at the Dollar Tree. Those were in their form. The Barbie tissues were in there and then that little toilet for Ava's dollhouse, that was in there. So just little things like that. But they get so excited. Um, <clears throat> let's see. I got him these. Remember back in the day when our parents would use the BO5? These smell so good. And I think these were like five something at Walmart. Like, yeah, they rang up 585, 595. I don't remember, but five at least. It was that. And this is <clears throat> Fresh Energy. It's the men three in one shampoo, conditioner, body wash. Oh, I love that smell. Mm like wakes up all my senses. I love that. And this one's called Ocean Surge and it's the VO5 also. I'm going to smell it because I can't really. Mmm, that smells good but man, this one is amazing. I love it. So, these were each 18 fluid ounces. So, that's at least $10 to $12 right here because I can't remember what they rang up and we got them for $2.50 for both. Yeah. Goodbye. I'm gonna get me a drink real quick. <clears throat> Sorry. Today, I mean, I've been on my my weight <clears throat> journey. A lot of people, and it'd be easier for me just to say on here real quick what I do or don't do, rather than texting each comment back what I do and repeating. <clears throat> I literally have. I try not to eat past six, but I do snack sometimes, and popcorn is one of my big, bigger snacks. I have a weakness for popcorn with the uh, Parmesan cheese. Um, I cut out all my pop. I drink water. I shouldn't drink bangs, but I do drink a bang. I can't give up my coffee, and it's a lot of calories and everything, but I compromised. I gave up pop. I'm not giving up my coffee. I have a cheat day sometimes, and today's my cheat day. I do have a grape Welch's pop in here. Oh my gosh, I love those things. I like great crush pops. But I got me a pop in there today, so I did kind of cheat. But um, try not to eat past six. Sometimes it can't be helped. Um, 
I don't go back for seconds. I've cut out, a, I love bread, I love cheese, I love butter, and I love potatoes. Love. So I try not to eat many potatoes, um, really trying to watch my bread. Um, yeah, I just really watch a lot of that kind of stuff. Haven't really been eating a lot of sugar lately, but I have been stuck on my good and plenties. And these little cinnamon candies that I got in this haul that I haven't uploaded yet that me and the grand girl, grandbabies did. But I just really watch a lot of stuff. I'm not even exercising yet, but when summer's here, I plan on start walking at the park again. And that's really when I'll start, because I'm at a plateau. I have been at this number for weeks and it's driving me crazy. I started at 177, 178. I'm 4'11". Yes, I'm rambling. Sorry, I am. I do ramble on this channel. So if you're new here, um, I'll just apologize now. But um, I'm down to, I keep going from I'm like 145 to 147. I keep fluctuating between those numbers right there. And I've been here for like weeks. So I know when I can get out there and start walking to stuff, that's when I'll start noticing the inchy, inches coming off my thighs, my hips, you know, a lot of the stuff that's still hanging on. But, um, and then going out to eat, we eat pizzas and we go out like that. We went to Texas Roadhouse today and used a gift card that we got. Um, I had salmon. I did kind of splurge on fried pickles. I had half of a roll because I'm watching my breads. Um, and I had green beans. So I just kind of try to watch it and compromise with things and not overindulge. But I do have cheat days. If I don't have a cheat day, I'm going to crash and just mess up my whole my whole plan. And it is taking me months. I'm 40. I'm going to be 40s. How old am I? 77. I'm gonna be 40, uh, 47? I was born in 77. Oh gosh, I don't even wanna think. Okay, I'm over 45. But anyway, um, just a few years ago, I could just say I wanna be on a diet, lose, lose weight like nothing, no problem, lose it fast. Now, if I say I'm on a diet, one week, nothing. Mm, week two, maybe half a pound. Oh my gosh. It's so awful to lose weight the older we get. It's like, you know, our metabolism slows down, our body's changing, our chemical balance, everything. But it is a lot harder. So it's been a struggle for me on this. So it's not been easy. And thank you for all the kind comments where people say they can tell I've lost weight. I mean, that's, it's a good motivator when you hear things like that. Because I have days I just want to give up. I really do. But I'm hanging in there. So... All right, and thank you for all the prayers and kind words for Ava's finger. It is feeling better. Um, the doctor said he's just going to see if it'll fuse itself back together. She's young. She's got those young, healthy bones, and they kind of can fix themselves better. And if we did it today, there would be no, probably no hope. But um, they're going to keep an eye on it, and hopefully it'll do that. She is starting to get a blood dot there, and if it keeps getting bigger, they're going to watch that. They'll have to um, possibly put her under and drill that just to release the pressure. But... Um, we're hoping and praying that we'll have to do that either. So, yeah, keep her in your thoughts and prayers and appreciate all the ones, all the prayer warriors out there and all my kind words. So, all right, I'll get back to this haul real quick. Oh, I know. I said I'd be done in a minute. My minute's extremely long. Oh, my gosh. I was so excited. Look what I found. Ours around here, none of them have it, the Dollar Trees. And I grabbed the last one and the lid was broke, but I don't care. Sulkin. I've been seeing everybody have this on their Dollar Tree hauls. I got the cleansing hand wash signature scent. I grabbed it. I haven't smelled it yet. I don't think I smelled it. I don't remember smelling it. Maybe I will as soon as I... Mmm, I smell it. Nope, I didn't smell it. That smells really, really good. Love it. It's that Sukin Australian Natural Signature, but this is the hand wash. Got the signature scent paraben free and um, it's infused with jojoba avocado and rosehip oils to gently cleanse leaving skin feeling nourished for all skin types this when i did this um, walmart scanner 29.99 29 30 bucks for this and this is 33.82 fluid ounces so it's one liter but oh my gosh i got the last one i found one i was so excited um, but like I said, my lids broke. I didn't care. And it was all the way in the back. Believe me, I got it. I got it. I stretched and I got it. 
So yay, one point for me. And these right here, I'm so addicted to. We grew up with these, but normally the Brock's brand. And I only got us one bag because I didn't know how they were gonna be. And they are full, these bags are full. And it is a 12 ounce bag. It's those little hard cinnamon candies, the solid candies. They taste just like the Brock's ones of where, I think it was Brock brand when we were growing up and we had um, cinnamon flavored, artificially flavored. This is the Coastal Bay Confections brand. Taste identical to them. Um, we just bought this a couple days ago. We're almost done with the first bag. So that's probably not good for my diet, but yeah, I've been chucking these in one after another. But love them and we got two naturally fat free. But there's seven, what? Oh, three pieces is a serving size and it's 70, cal 70 calories for three. Well, I have a lot of calories in me today just from these alone, but we bought two. So excited. And we looked everywhere and could not find them. Couldn't find them. Was at the checkout, just looking around as you know you do when you're standing there at the checkout. And I looked over there and there was more. It was right there on the end aisle. I don't know how many times we walked past it. So excited to find it though. And then <clears throat> I think <clears throat> this was $8.99. This is the Drew, Bra Drew Barrymore brand flower. And they only had one color. It comes just in this little clear packaging. I really don't know how it comes in the store. Maybe it comes like that because she's just such a simple, sweet person. Your girl next door kind of person. So I could see her packaging like this. Nothing fancy smancy because she doesn't need it. Um, here, let's do a swatch. Yeah, yeah, he was even helping me dig in there because I didn't see these in the first time. We went back because when we decided to get the girls a couple more little things to surprise them in the room for next time they come over. And these were just sitting there. Oh. Okay, cute little simple package. And it does say flowers on there. I don't know if you can see it, but it does. Doesn't smell like anything. Oh, this is real pink. Why did I think it was like a burgundy red? Ooh. Okay. <laughs> I probably won't be wearing that. No. I like more of neutral brown colors, maybe soft burgundies, but no. I'll put on one here. Like you all. Oh, oh my word. Oh, oh, it's making me cringe. Here, let's not, let's just dab it. Mm. Mm-hmm. Gotta try it at least once. God, I already made a mess up. Look at me, y'all. <laughs> what? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe if I dab a lot of off. See, then I look more vibrant and pink there than what it does here. It might not be too bad. I have to grow on me. I don't know. But anyway, it's her brand. It is number 65 and it's called Rosy Garden Matte. Cool. Cool beans. Okay. And then showed you Ava's little things. Well, you'll understand if you watch the haul before this one, or I don't know how they're going to upload in what order, but it's going to be the one with the grandbabies in the picture. That haul, um, Mia decorates her room and she's got a beautiful village for Christmas. It's got the big houses and the towns and stuff like that. And it's all lit up. It's so pretty. She's got the faux snow and then she changes it, I think with her seasons. Well, they got the spring collection out there and we got her another mushroom thing so there's that and we went ahead and got they have accessories I think she just got a bunch of the little houses so they have all kinds of stuff like this and we went ahead and got her a tree and this on the it's on the rope the jute rope stuff so he'll be able to swing but yeah we thought that'd be cute cute might be a thumbnail I don't know okay so there's that. Two more quick bags and I'll be done. You guys don't have to listen to me anymore. Anymore. I'm so excited. Yes. I found it. 
found one. I found one. Literally, they have to be flying off the shelves. Everybody must be snatching them up as soon as they put them out. We love animal crackers. So we got one for the girls. Got one for us. It is just the eight ounces, but it's a nice size bag. So it's not full. A little over halfway. But yeah, we love these. So we got those. Kind of noisy. Get them out of the way. My husband loves bubble gum. Mmm. Um, he picked green stickle, double bubble. So that's what he got. Cause he's like a big kid. Excuse me, I, mean, I don't drink pop much. I do, um, if I have pop any, it's usually like root beer. And that's just, I'll have that not even on a cheat day. I just will random have a root beer or something like that. But if I'm cheating on pop, it's usually on a Sunday or something like that. And we got some of these, never had them before, Cake Kings, but I've seen them on a haul. And we love those little cinnamon crumb coffee cakes in a little two pack. And I'm hoping that's what that tastes like because we both love those. So we're gonna try them thinking they even had chocolate, but I love anything cinnamon. Cinnamon. And then I love me some good and plenty. So I got me twin more boxes. Two more boxes. And then, oh, he got him some, just some little more reading glasses because he loses these all the time. I guess he's a 1.75, but yeah. So he just got him another pair of those. It's worth buying there for as much as he forgets them, loses them, and leaves them places, sets on them or whatever. So I'd rather pay that price than anything else. And then I got me some of those. I get to Craven chocolate. This is lower calories than a chocolate candy bar, which I would prefer, but it's 100 calories. And me and the girls love these. I'm gonna take a box to work for waters and I'll leave one here, but we got that. And it is the Berry Blue Typhoon. And there is eight drink mix packs in here. I have to do this to drink water. People say water doesn't have a flavor. Yes, it does. And it's a nasty flavor. I don't like it. And I only like Ice Mountain. Um, maybe it's just because I've drank it so long, so I'm like, I'm only Ice Mountain. But um, I'll drink it if I can put a Kool-Aid packet in it. Then it's good. But I don't like it by itself. Oh, I did get me some, is it Bi? Bi? I don't know. Antioxidant Cocoa Fusion Molokai Coconut Water. Eight, 18 fluid ounces. And it is only 10 calories for this whole bottle. It's supposed to be good for you. And I got one. So, I'm going to try that. It does talk about a little bit on the back. Exotic flavor that sends your tongue on a tropical tastication. So, I've got that. Oh, I fibbed. Um, we actually got three boxes of those. So, I'll take one to work and leave the other two here. And he loves um, butterscotch. No problem there. I'm not going to be snatching any of those. I don't like butterscotch. I like the butterscotch hard candies, like those red ones. Um, but I can't eat butterscotch cake, bread, anything else. I'm like that with bananas. I love banana and banana bread, banana chips, banana candy, any of that. Ugh. It's, it's, I can't do it. I can't do it. So there's that. And that's it. So how old is this? Almost exactly one hour. It's 59 minutes and six seconds. All right, thank you everybody. This is my little haul. Um, that's Costco and all this was the Dollar Tree. I hope everybody had a great weekend. Unfortunately, it's Sunday evening. What time is it? 6.42. Back to the drawing board. Time to make the bread tomorrow. So, all right. Thanks again, and I will talk to you guys next time. Hopefully, I'll have one, at least one, maybe both videos up tomorrow. I do have a Sheen order on the way, and I do have a Timu order on the way. I told the grandbabies they could order. They'll have a $30 limit and for each, and they're going to get on Timu, and they're going to buy their little things, order that, and they're going to do a Timu haul. So, they're pretty stoked about that. So it'll be a little while coming. We haven't even ordered that yet. All right.
thank you everybody for watching i appreciate it again thank you for your support on my channel and until next time okay talk to you guys later bye